Well, first responders in DeSoto, they are being honored for saving a woman's life on Christmas Eve. The 77-year-old collapsed and was clinically dead, but thanks to a team effort, including from her own grandson, she was brought back to life. NBC5's Keaton Willard shows us just how the family got to thank their heroes. At DeSoto City Hall, a standing ovation for a group of firefighters, 911 operators, and EMTs. Because of them, 77-year-old Gail Ward is still here today. Just to be able to thank them in person, uh, obviously they're in the middle of doing their job, and they were certainly uh, professional and, and saved her life without a doubt. On Christmas Eve, Jeff Ward was heading to his mother's home on Ricky Canyon Drive. He soon got a call from his brother. Gail Ward had collapsed. She wasn't breathing and didn't have a pulse. I, I really thought that we had lost my mom that night. Yeah, I, I, I thought that, you know, there was no way that, that a Christmas miracle was going to occur, but, but it did. When Ward arrived, he found firefighters doing compressions, taking over for his 19-year-old nephew, who had to be taught CPR over the phone by a 911 operator. After eight minutes, Gail Ward had a pulse again, and an ambulance arrived to take her to the hospital. She was put in a medically induced coma, but survived. And months later, she's now back home with her family. What an honor uh, tonight to be able to present life-saving awards uh, to our firefighters and our uh, dispatchers at the SWRCC. Come Tonight, the first responders who came to Ward's aid received the city's lifesaver award. And Jeff Ward got to thank them for giving him his mom back. I just know that, you know, uh, my mom having lived here over 50 years, that she's very proud and very thankful of all the people that showed up that night. And uh, she has her life uh, to, to, to thank those folks for. In DeSoto, Keenan Willard, NBC5.